I'm Jerry Kokesh, Biathlon World Editor in Ruppolding, Germany, where BMW IBU World Cup 5 just wrapped up. Real winter arrived this week here for the first time all season, making a spectacular backdrop but challenging conditions for almost every competition. Olympic and world champion Martin Fourcade kicked off the second week of Bavarian-style biathlon, winning the 20K over Simon Eder, the man who beat him in last week's mass start. Italy's Dorothea Weir won her second 15K of the season, shooting clean to finish almost a minute ahead of Kaisa Makarainen and Gabriella Sukalova. I said to the Red Bull, bye bye, we will see us maybe next year or something. <laughs> and But finally, um, it's the shooting, it's the most important and the individual, so I think I did it and it's good. <laughs> the men's relay, again, was the all Norway show, especially once Tarje Bo opened up over a one minute gap with his blazing ski performance. Svensson used a couple of spare rounds in the final shooting stage, but he still finished comfortably ahead of Russia and Austria. Saturday's mass starts were a battle not just among competitors, but also against the weather. Gabriela Sukalva punched the sky in victory after dropping all 20 targets, sealing her 10th career World Cup victory. Germany's Franziska Hildebrand and Laura Dahlmeier benefited from Marie Duran Haber's three penalties, giving them places two and three on the podium. The seemingly unstoppable Martin Fourcade was slowed by Germany's Eric Lesser, who shot clean and finished a few seconds ahead of Fourcade in the mass start. There was a sigh of relief from the German men with his victory as it gave them the first win in two weeks here in Ruppolding. Eric, what did you do special today to win? <laughs> uh, clean shooting and a relaxed first lap. <laughs> the closing women's relay was the All Ukraine Show even when Germany's Laura Dahlmeier challenged for first place. Olympic champion Alina Pedrushna was able to hold off the young German and seal victory for her Ukrainian team. It has been a great week here in Ruppolding, especially for the Yellow Bibs, Martin Fourcade and Gabriela Sukalova, who both increased their leads in the World Cup total score. Now the World Cup circus heads down the Autobahn to sunny, wintry Antolz for World Cup number six.